The first one was held by Mr. Hackett, and it was dynamic. That's the one got me in trouble. <laughs> For telling the truth. Right. For telling the truth. But sometimes bad news is just the wrong view. Uh, those things needed to be said. Okay, the second form, it was downtown on Main Street. Okay, the held by the uh, Fort Wayne Leadership Group. And it was a little bigger, Mr. Hackley, it was a little bigger. The third form was at the uh, Macmillan Center. And it was bigger yet. That's when I said it looks like these forms are getting better and better. And so the one Monday night, it was the biggest of all of them. Amen. And it was dynamic, I thought. Now, I was glad to see each one of you. I was. I know that you were busy and you were busy and you were busy and everybody was busy. I was, but I was glad to see you. But now in retrospect, you know what I should have done, Mr. Payne? I should have stood right beside the mayor. And every time he said something, I would have been next. You learn from your experience, or you should learn. But after all, I had heard enough. I had heard enough. And that's when I, I said, I'm getting tired of hearing all this, what you're doing. And uh, you're going to fix the streets now, and after eight years, you ain't never fix them. All of a sudden, you're trying to do this. And then uh, he said something that made the people happy. He said, because he's been getting around talking to some of us, what do you need in the Southeast? We need a sit-down restaurant. And so that's the reason why he said if he find a, a developer that would put a sit-down restaurant in the South Beach, he'll give them the land. And then we, I, I, I was upset. I was upset. That's when I, I, I took it. And I've been told, you got to attack him. You got to attack And my philosophy is this. I, I see you got one of your twins with you, maybe. Uh, but uh, my philosophy is all right. I'm not running against Tom Henry. I'm running for. I'm running for equality of all people. I'm running for justice for all people. I'm running to do a better job. Uh, so I'm not running against him. But it looked like I had to say something. I was tired of that. I was just sick and tired of it. Some of you heard me say, I promise you, I will not throw a rock, Lamar, and hide my hand. And nobody knew what I was saying. But I said that Rick told them to ask me. And, but what I was, I was really trying to get them to understand what the mayor has been doing. You know, you can fool some of the people some of the time, but you can't fool all the people all the time. But that's what he was doing, and it made me sick because he's he thinking that everybody is gullible and they're going to go for that. Well, I wanted to let him know that we're smarter than that. You can fool somebody, but you ain't fooling everybody. So I was had enough, and I said that. And I was ready to leave after that. And so anyhow, the news media, they talked to media, they talked to me afterward, and they said, do you feel that you was on your own turf? I said, yes. Yeah. Why do you feel that way? Because I am a native of Fort Wayne. And you hear me talking about Olivia Page, you hear me talking about Tony Harvey and the Knox and so forth. I know all them families. I know the Harrington's, I know the Chapman's, I know the Woods, I know the Scrubs, I know all of them families, the Braggs, the Brookses, I know all of them, and they know me. And not only that, Mark, Mark Haley, but I'm an ex-ball uh -oh. player. <laughs> I used to, 
before they even were talking about you, they was talking about me. <laughs> but it's been so long ago that it's just a few of us still remember. I ain't saying that, Debbie. <laughs> it's a few of us that remember. And so even back when I was like you, Mark Hayden, real similar to you. And I know that you are a captain of the football team and you're a freshman. That's outstanding. But I also know you're an excellent student. That's more than outstanding. And of that, you can be the next trustee. You can be the next mayor. I support putting your best foot forward. And that's what I was all about. And it's paying off. If, uh, uh, one of my brothers here, uh, so, but I got a whole bunch of other brothers. But the brother here, it, it, it empowers me. But this brother here, Paige, used to call me Joseph. You know who Joseph is. <laughs> but that was an encouragement. My brother called me that. And my sisters, were, uh, when they got on me about the police, she was mad. Let me tell you something. You've always been open and supportive to other people. Always. And I was glad. I'm glad. My brother-in-law knows that. I support everybody knows that. And if everybody knows who I am, there's no reason why I shouldn't be the mayor of Port 